Hi peoples. I'll just do a quick prayer. Hi Lord, please let the words of my mouth and the meditations of my heart be acceptable in your sight. Thank you, Abba. Okay, so God is a motorcycle, is a Harley. Alright, so he's he's like freedom. I don't know if you've ever experienced it. You get yourself something like this. I suspect that's an Indian. I typed in Harley, but looks too cool for a Harley. <laughs> I, I never got one because I don't like working on stuff. But anyway, you get a Harley, right? And because uh, you dream of being free and riding around and you're free. It's a symbol of freedom. All right, cruising around. So then, you know, you find someone else who's, who's on the same page as you and you cruise around with them. That's, that's great. All right, so happy days. Got your bike cruising around, and uh, they say, "Oh, come and join our church." You got you got to come to this church because uh, yeah, that's what that's what you do when you get a when you get free. Once you're free, you join the church. All right. So, oh, okay. All right. Then you join your church. Right. And, and they all seem good and they're all mates and everything. And uh, yeah, your church has new rules and stuff and all that sort of thing. You got to do the things they do because. Uh, that's, you're a part of something now. You've um, joined your church. Alright. So this is the thing. So when you get your your Harley right. You've got God. <laughs> you're free. <laughs> right. This is the thing you should be learning from. You should be with God. Cruising around with God. Uh, and learning along the way. With him. And this is your teaching tour. Alright. You're on with him. But you've just gone and joined your gang. Don't join no gang. All right. Don't worry about your gang. All right. Just get get God. Get the handbook, which is the King James Bible, and the Strong's Concordance is also the other part of the King James Bible. So it will help you understand every word that's in there. Our words nowadays have changed, and they're all wrong. Our understanding is wrong. So the definitions and everything are in the Strong's Concordance. All right, people say, oh, King James is wrong. Well, it's not. It's just they don't have the strong concordance. Okay, so, and this is it. This is you and God, right? There's God, there's you. Yoo-hoo! All right, and you're off. And then it's you and God together, right, against the rest of the world. That's the whole way God works, all right? There you go. This is your trip to being saved, all right? It's you and God. Don't worry about no churches, none of that stuff, any of that rubbish. Get out of them churches if you're any of those. The only time you go to a church is just for praise, right, and to share um, things that you've learnt. Most church, all the churches actually now just preach at you. They just stand on the top, you take what we tell you, and that's it. That's rubbish. You go there for fellowship, and you go there to share what you've learnt from the Holy Spirit, because the Holy Spirit is your teacher. That fellow at the church is not your teacher, all right? The Holy Spirit is always your teacher. So get the King James Bible, your Harley, all right? And um, and God, all right? And the Holy Spirit is God, all right? And that's it. There you go. You're on your way to being saved. So it's that simple. And uh, always ask him. Okay, and you'll find when you ask questions all the time, when you ask, please, can you show me this, something will show up, something will turn up. Try it. Start a little notebook. Put whatever question it is you're asking in there, all right, and tick off the ones that got answered, and, and the ones that didn't, just keep asking. Please, God, show me what this is. Please, God, show me what this is, all right, and he tailors everything for you. It'll come out in the way that you can see it. It'll be on a number plate or a bird singing or whatever. I don't know how you think, but he does. All right. All you got to do is be looking. Watch. Be watchful and be mindful all the time. That's what... Um, well, I just got that. That's what pray, um, pray all the time continuously means is have God on your mind all the time. All right. So just always think, always have him involved in your life. Alrighty, so there you go. Hope that helped. God bless.